Hey lovely people of the internet, so today is a Harry Potter video and today I wanted to do my top 10 Harry Potter characters. Boy was this actually quite difficult. So without further ado, in at number 10 is Hagrid. I just love Hagrid, he's just a cuddly friendly giant in every stereotypical sense of the word and I love how often he isn't going to tell them something and then he does. He's just a really funny character and I think what's great about Hagrid is he's that first character who makes Harry feel special. At number nine is Draco Malfoy. There has always got to be one slightly villainous character that you actually quite like and have a bit of a soft spot for and yeah it's got to be Draco. I think he's he's a conflicted character and he probably has the most growth I think throughout the entire book series um but yeah so my number nine. At number eight is Neville Longbottom. I love him. He's that understated character who it's not right up until sort of like the final books that you start to be like actually Neville's pretty good. Um yeah love Neville. At number seven is Molly Weasley. I love the fact that she's strong and powerful. She can take on anyone. I also think as well the fact that she was played by Julie Walters in the films probably influences my decision because she makes her a super funny, lovable character. At number six is Hermione. Again, she is a strong, powerful, intelligent female character. And yeah, she can take them all on. She's pretty, she's pretty cool. Number five is Professor McGonagall. She is definitely one of my favorite professors. She's got a very quick wit. Some of her jokes are quite subtle. She's really stern, but she always shows that slight soft spot for her students. And yeah, she's just pretty cool. Number four is Dumbledore. Who wouldn't love Dumbledore? He can be a little bit mysterious, but he's, and he's a little bit quirky as well in some of his preferences, like the fact he's always wanted a pair of socks, nothing else, just a pair of socks for Christmas. Um, and he loves lemon sherbets. But yeah, and he's just, but he's just a lovable character. And again, he's one of those characters that makes Harry feel special when he hasn't before, which is super cool. Yeah, Dumbledore, great character. In the number three spot is Luna Lovegood. I love the fact that half the time people think she doesn't really know what's going on and that she's a little bit out there and not with it, but actually she's probably one of the most with it characters in her own way. She has probably some of the best advice for Harry. And yeah, she totally grows on you. And I think I definitely dressed up as her for World Book Day once at school. <laughs> in at number two is Ginny Weasley. I love her again, she's another strong, intelligent, kick-ass female character. I love the fact that even when Harry goes off to do his adventure she's like well I'm still going to do my part back here so screw you. Um, but yeah and I think also she's one of those characters that yeah, she grows as well so much throughout the entire series. She starts off as this little shy girl who can't even talk to Harry and by the end she's like giving it just as much and she's just as good. <laughs> and in the number one spot is Dobby. I've always loved Dobby. I just think he's a super cute character. I hate his death in the film. Sorry if that's a spoiler for anyone watching. Um, but yeah, and he's just adorable. He goes from being this quite irritating character when he's first introduced to probably one of the most lovable in my opinion. And as always, there is a bonus. I mostly wanted to focus my top 10 on the Harry Potter characters, but if we are talking about the wizarding world, one of my absolute favourite characters has got to be Queenie Goldstein from the Fantastic Beasts films. I think she's just super awesome. She's quirky, she's different, but she's so strong and courageous, yeah. And that is it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, do hit that thumbs up button. If, if you haven't already, do hit the let me know down in the comments what you thought of my top 10, what your top 10 is, what your top one character is. Any general comments about Harry Potter, always much appreciated. I'll pop some links here to some other videos that of mine that you may enjoy and I will see you in my next one. See ya!